what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Aim High, and I'm here with a tier list. Yes, a tier list. We are ranking the best fast food, fast casual restaurants, and we're gonna go from the best to A to B to C to all the way to D and F tiers to not even had. I'm sure there's a lot of restaurants on this list. I'm sure I haven't had all of them, but I'm gonna do my best to rate them. And whatever I say, that's whatever goes. You already know. You already feel. You already feel me. That's whatever goes. What I say goes my way or the highway. Let's get into the list, boy. All right. So this is what the ranking and the tier list is gonna shake out to. We got S, A, B, C, D, F. I don't know why they skipped E. That's so weird. And never had. Okay. I'm gonna try my best to give you the most accurate representation possible because I know you come here to Aim High's channel to strictly find out what restaurants you should be eating at and what you should not be eating at. And let me tell you something, you're correct on that assumption. You should be doing that. You should be coming to me for all your basic needs, okay? And we're gonna start right out of the gate with A&W. Listen, all American food, A&W, the only thing that I've ever had from here is the root beer floats and some burgers. I'm gonna be honest to you, their food is dog shit. Their food is trash. Root beers, the root beer's okay. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't even think A&W is a top tier root beer. I don't. I don't. I, I honestly, I think Barks is better, and I think any other root beer besides Mug. Mug is just garbage. Mug is just awful. We don't need to have Mug. So A and W is better than Mug. I'll give it that. So for that, I'll put this in. A, I'll put this in D. I'm gonna put this in D tier. Okay. Chat already knows that I love me some Arby's. Okay. I love Arby's. Okay. They have the meats. A classic roast beef sandwich is a staple in fast food. I'm not kidding you. It is a staple. Their mozzarella sticks are to die for. I don't know what they bred the mozzarella sticks in, but listen to me. If you have never had mozzarella sticks from Arby's, hashtag ad. If you've never had mozzarella sticks from Arby's, please go get some. And please do me this. You're going to be doing yourself a disservice if you don't do this. Please, please, please go get honey mustard with your mozzarella sticks. I know that sounds crazy. Arby's mozzarella sticks with honey mustard actually slap. This is a solid A for me. This is a solid A for me. That may shock some people, but it's a solid A for me. Bojangles, I'm gonna put this at a C. I'm gonna put this at a C. Boston Market, uh, listen, I've had it. I haven't had it in a long time. And when I say long time, I'm talking like a decade. Burger King, D. They got their chicken fries. Okay, I will say this. They don't have them any, if they had them, it, they'd go up to C. They don't. Um, Canes, solid. I'm gonna put Canes at a B. Up A. I'm gonna put Canes at an A. I like Canes. Carl's Jr. Listen, man. B. I'm gonna put it at a B. Checkers, it is what it is. Like, I... Their food is like late night food. You know what I mean? Like, if you just have nowhere else to go. Chick-fil-A, that's an S. Chipotle is an S. Churches is a D. Cookout is a C. Culver's is a B. Del Taco, I'm gonna be honest, I've never had it. I'm gonna be honest, I've never had Del Taco. I've just never had it. I I, I, I don't know, Cook, the, re, checkers and cookout are very much similar to me. I live in Atlanta. They're just both around me all the time. And they're just mid, they're just mid. They're just mid food. They're mid food. I, it just is. Denny's is a D. Um, If anyone knows what I'm about to say, if anyone knows what this is from, please comment in the comments below. You guys ever seen that like metal dance? Like where they're having like a concert at Denny's and it's like just metal. It's like, duh, 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 duh. and then the guy grabs the mic and he goes, what the fuck is up Denny's? It's my favorite video of all time. And it's going to get a D. It probably should get an F, but because Denny's is not afraid to host local concerts inside their restaurant, I'm going to give him a, a D. Domino's C. I don't know. All pizza on this list should just get a C. It's not good pizza. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's just be real about it. Let's just be honest with each other, right? It's just no fast food pizza is good, really. Uh, Dairy Queen, I'm gonna put as a B. Not only does Dairy Queen get B for their sweets and their treats, when I was a kid, nothing slapped harder than a fucking Dilly Bar, dude. Nothing. And Dilly Bars low key still go hard, okay? Blizzards obviously go hard. Just normal ice cream, they go hard. Shakes go hard. Drinks, they go hard. Listen, I don't know much about their food, but one, I do know a lot about one in particular product, and that's the chicken strips. There's nothing like going to Dairy Queen, getting the chicken strip basket and you open it up to see your big Texas toast, your fries, your chicken strips. Oh, what's that white bowl? That's white gravy. Pause. 
and that gravy's good. Extra pause. And it's good, it's good, it's solid. I'm gonna give it a B tier. Polo Loco, I've never had it. I don't even know what the fuck that is. Firehouse Subs, I'm gonna be honest, I've never had it. I know what it is. I've had plenty of chances to go there, but eh, try harder. I'm not gonna go there. Five Guys and A. Listen, Five Guys burgers are really good. If Five Guys burgers were more affordable, I would put it S tier, okay? Me and my chat, we've had long talks about Five Guys. This is a little too expensive. It just is. This is a little too expensive. IHOP. Listen, IHOP is, is very close to home for me. And here's why. When I was getting drunk, like a lot, and doing my thing, a lot of drunk evenings ended with IHOP. Whether that be chicken and waffles, whether that be um, just some good old fashioned pancakes, French toast, it didn't matter, okay? IHOP was getting it and it could still get it. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna do B. I'm gonna say B. I like IHOP. I fuck with IHOP. I'm gonna put in and out on it. Nah. In and out an A. And this is why I'm gonna tell you why, okay? In and out, definitely a Cali thing. Um, however, I just Listen, it's not an S tier. I don't even know. I'm debating on if there was something in between A and B. I know that I can create another tier. If there was something between A and B, I would put it there. I'm not going to create one, but I'm just saying like if it, 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 would, it would be in the middle here because I like in and out I do. I do. Me personally, I like in and out However, I am not, I, I'm man enough to say, I am man enough to say that it's, it's overrated. It's overrated. It is. And that's okay. It's okay to be overrated. It's okay. Jack in the Box is a solid C. Could be a B. I'm gonna leave it at a C. The Jack in the Box has your back, okay? Late night, if you're high or you're drunk or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Lord knows what you're doing out there on that Saturday night, Timmy. Jack in the Box is for you, okay? Jersey Mike's, a sub above. I actually fuck heavy with Jersey Mike's. This shit fucks, I'm telling you. They have a nice sandwich. It's like an Italian type of sandwich. It might be a Hawaiian. I don't know what they have that I like. They they have an Italian sub where they just coat that shit on there, dude. They just, they're pouring oil and vinegar and salt and pepper on there. Jersey Mike's is good. I like Jersey Mike's. Jimmy John's, also a sub place. I will also put in B tier. KFC, listen, I used to go to a KFC buffet. Uh, it was $5, and it was just a buffet for KFC. And I'm telling you, man, um, this was some real good buffet KFC food. But I was also 17, 18 years old. Um, and I don't think I would have the same aspirations of going to get KFC every Wednesday for $5 as I did then. But because I respect myself then, I'm going to put it in a C. I'll put it in a C. Uh, Little Caesars, C. LJS is going to get a D from me. Listen, moving on to McDonald's, this is, as my chat like to put it, and listen, you could be a part of that chat if you come and hang out, twitch.tv slash aim high, Monday through Friday, start around 7 p.m. Iconic is the word. And what matches iconic on this list right here? The McDonald's. McDonald's is an iconic level restaurant. McFlurry, apple pies, McDoubles, McChickens, Big Mac, chicken nuggets, their barbecue sauce, 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 the Mulan sauce, the McRib, Shamrock Shake. They've come up and they've served their dues, okay? They have led the fast food industry forward. McDonald's is an A tier. Their fries have crack on them, dude. Like, they're an A tier. Panda Express. I'm I'm right here. I'm right here. But I'm not gonna lie to you. It's worn off on me. I used to, there was a time in my life where I would put Panda Express in S tier. I'm not even kidding you. Panera Bread. Very solid. I'll put it in B as well. Papa John's. The only pizza place that deserves to be at a B. Popeyes. Look, I gotta put it in S tier. Here's the reason why. Their chicken is better than Chick Fil A. Their sandwich is not better than Chick Fil A. I will stand by that 100. I. It's not not that I don't like Popeyes chicken sandwich. Which I do. It's just not as good as Chick-fil-A sandwich. Quidoba, I mean, C, I don't know. It's the same thing as Chipotle. I just fuck with Chipotle more. I know a lot of people, my brother, my brother likes likes Quidoba better than Chipotle. You know, it's a preference thing. I'm not going to hate you if you like Quidoba better than Chipotle. Uh, Roy Rogers, I'm going to be honest. I don't even know. Sparrow, I like their pizza. I'm going to put it at C. Slotsky's, C. Shake Shack, we'll go to B. I know, I know people love Shake Shack. Sonic actually fucks, but we'll put it at a C. Steak and shake is just d you know what there's got to be some f tiers here white castle waffle house is a solid b i'm not even i'm not even gonna play with subway is a is is b subway is the best sub place though because of their cookie 
And in, in fact, the word that I would use for them is dank. Their cookies are dank. Taco Bell, A. Torchy's Tacos? They have Torchy's Tacos here? S tier. Wawa, I've, I know there's some people in chat that are going to be mad at me because I've been glancing over there. I don't know what Wawa's is. I'm not even going to lie to you. I have to put I've, I've, I've never had it. I'm sorry. Wendy's is a B. Whataburger, I guess we'll put an A. This shit, I've never had this shit in my life. Wingstop, B. Zaxby's, B. Listen, in order, going from left to right, that's what I'm doing right there. That's what I'm doing. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing right there. Shake Shack is probably one. You know what? This is fine. This is this is fine. This is fine. Okay, let's let's fix C. Cause C C should not be like this. That's what we're gonna do. That's C. That is C. That's what we're gonna do. That is my tier list. Okay, guys, we did it. That is it. That is the tier list. Okay, Torchy's Tacos on top. If you've never had it, um, you're missing out, okay? I don't know what to tell you. I had it in Austin, Texas. I don't know where else it is. That's why I was so shocked to see it on this list. I've never seen it outside of Austin, Texas. So listen, if you're in Austin or the Texas area, you got to have Torchy's Tacos, okay? I love it to death. Sweet tea. Oh my gosh. Yo, okay. That was my list. Okay, for fast food, casual restaurants, Torchy's Taco, it gets the top notch in S tier, A tier, Arby's, B tier, Shake Shack, C tier, Sonic. Listen, you come to me for advice. You come to me for knowledge and I'm giving you, I'm, I'm literally leading you to the water. I can't help you drink. I can't help you drink, but I can lead you to the promised land. And that's what I did here today. Listen, if you like these videos, please thumbs up subscribe you know the whole deal but also we want you to come here and hang out and chat okay if you see this video and you haven't been to one of my live streams i want you to come and hang out okay twitch.tv slash aim high i love you thank you for watching this video and you better have a great day at the family barbecue see you later my puss